that. You ever touch any of your grandkids? No, never. Kind of hard for me to believe. All I can do is say the truth. I've never touched it. Anybody I thought about it, but I never did. Just thought about it. Yeah. Yeah. Don't you know on the internet? Talking to a decoy, but you don't know it yet. It's CBP, West Virginia with the challenge. Tracking you by your IP, we got your bottle balls. We're chatting goes wrong on the internet. Talking to a decoy, but you don't know it yet. It's CBP, West Virginia with the challenge. Tracking you by the IP, we got your bottle balls. Open that piece, Vanessa. Is they serious? Or they're delirious? So we took it to another state because they're still curious. From Colorado to West Virginia, Rocky to the Appalachian. Putting the pedal to the metal for pedals and demonstrate. Got Tommy orchestrating, Vanessa duplicating. Catching weirdos on the daily, they the most hated and the highest rated. Catching cops, retired pops, and creepy husbands. Looking for kids that ain't up in the age of a dozen. Be aware and don't be surprised if you see your cousin or your baby daddy while you got one in the oven. Better hide your kids and hide your wife, no fun intended. The jig is up, now you got to witness a marriage ending. And once again, this is your first time messing with children. And this is the second time you're hearing from the homie voice. Another intro in the beat with a familiar voice. Popping up like Chris Hansen and he brought the bad boy. Talking to a decoy, but you don't know it yet. It's CPP, West Virginia with the challenge. Tracking you by your IP, we got your bottle balls. We're chatting goes wrong on the internet. Talking to a decoy, but you don't know it yet. It's CPP, West Virginia with the challenge. Tracking you by the IP, we got your bottle balls. Over till it's over. Yeah, and she has to live right up the road from him, guys. Just a walk, a walk up from him. Well, why did she? Did she say she ever turned it into the cops? Uh, no. Um, she said that she grabbed him and like away and like almost down the stairs and. Her mom said that she would get in trouble for hurting him or something. So, and she, I, she acts like she don't like the police anyway. Right. Um, so, Absolutely. Lot, I mean, you know, a lot of people that don't want to have anything to do with the police let stuff like that go because they don't want to have anything to do with the police. 
Mm. All right, we're gonna bang on the door one more time, guys. And if he doesn't answer, we're gonna take uh, go to this other place. She said the truck could leave. Them. Put down over here because I can't see a thing. <laughs> oh, it's gross. I need to talk to you, John. Everybody, just get out of there. <laughs> it's disgusting. <laughs> You know what, though? <coughs> he might be at the girlfriend's. All right, then. Come on. Um, it it kind of makes a little bit of sense. All right, so listen. He's not answering the door. So, the next best thing is to try to get the girlfriend's address. No, it's not a condemn tag. Said no trespassing. <coughs> yeah, he has a girlfriend vest. Yeah. Oh gosh. I just thought everyone's car was a cigarette. Look at you. What the heck? <laughs> that makes sense though. Well, he's gonna bust me up. Um the same oh. town she lives in. Oh ugh, gross. Is the same town he supposedly works in. Right? We're gonna find this. We're gonna find him. We're gonna last find thing him. We do. We're gonna find him. I'm coming. I'm a coming. I'm a coming.
Well, he's talking to Namor. Girls. Um, Namor, underage girls. Um, talking to a 14 year old, 11 year old. That's just what I know about. Um, he's been talking to more. He's seen him in the first pictures of himself. Um, I'm sure you get it. <laughs> Um, well, I'll tell you what, it's not kind of been iffy between us for years. Mm. I'm sorry to have to tell you this, I can tell you're shook up about it. Yeah, we know her mic's off. We can either plug in the mic or plug in the phone. So there, you can either hear her, you can either hear her, or you can see her. I should go feed it a little bit. <laughs> I bet 
I bet somebody hacked my account. Even though I've we had people do this before. But we tracked the address. John, we have your IP address. Yeah. Do you know what that means? Uh -uh. It means it comes straight to you. Straight to your phone. Well, I, I just... Straight to your address. I just switched my phone, too. Pings. Straight to you. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah, I don't... That's the only thing I can guess is somebody hacked my account again, and so, I, I can go so, back in. And okay, so if somebody if somebody hacked they hacked your Facebook. Yeah. Okay. But that's happened like two so or three times. So if somebody times. hacked your Facebook, uh -huh. they would have your Facebook, right? Yeah. Your Facebook. They'd have my Facebook, my identity. They would have pretty much everything because they they did this to me before. And they would be at your house when we pinged you, pinged them. What's so that? They like. Like if you, if we pinged your address, if you were talking okay, about your, your from phone, here. an IP address is like a GPS. Yeah. You huh. know what GPS is, okay? Yeah. Okay. So wherever you're using that phone at, talking to someone, that IP address is just like a GPS. It tracks right to you mm -hmm. within feet okay. of you. So why would it track to you? That with. That would your be, picture, your name, your yeah, face. Yeah, I was gonna say is it had, like I said, I've had people steal my identity before, and I had okay. to, I had to go through all this. Record you realize work. this is illegal. You realize this is felonies. Yeah. you've committed yeah. felonies here. Well, somebody did it, and so even it, if you say hack, though, the police are gonna see that it went to you, not to somebody else. So yeah. if you, if got you're, all the police, if, if you're telling me. You. Somebody hacked your phone and this was not you, I have to call the police. Mm -hmm. I have to get them here to check that phone. Okay. And even if it even if you erased any messages, it they shows can find up. them. They yeah. will find them. Yeah. Everything shows up. Yeah. Um I could Okay, so tell me this. Tell me this one. They hacked your account. Okay. But they wouldn't have a picture of your would they? Unless it was theirs. How would they take a picture in your bedroom? And she's already well, I knows have, well, I in the bedroom. She's already I, seen it. She knows it's your. I haven't even been over. My John, place for wow. a long time. come on! Oh my gosh. No, really, I haven't. Everybody in this room knows you're lying. What do you want me to say? I want you to tell the truth. Well, we can call the cops and we can tell them. You know, you well, got hacked. I, John, it's. I mean, it's it's your buddy. It's your. It's it, this is your girlfriend. She knows what your looks like. It's your in your house, in your trailer. Oh. Okay. So get honest. So can you be honest? Yeah, just tell the truth. Have some remorse. Okay, yeah, yeah, I, it's an I eleven did, year old. I did talk to younger girl. Yep, mm -hmm. I did. But I I. That picture, I got. I don't. I don't care. Yeah. It doesn't okay. matter. I don't care how old it is. I don't care if you took it 20 years ago. I don't care if you got it off of Google and it's not even yours. Okay. You sent it. It comes from your phone. You sent that to an 11 year old. 11 year old. Okay. 11. People. people it's like lie a fifth on, grader. People lie on the internet. Mm -hmm. I mean, See, they, so she's so she, now she's lying. Well, a lot a lot of people that I have talked to on the internet, okay. they they boldface lied to. Me. Okay. I mean, so even if even if this person's lying, okay, even if this isn't a child, mm -hmm. when she said I'm 11 years old, you should have run for the hills. Oh. But what did you say? What did you tell her? Can't remember. That you like younger? Well, I told her I, I said I like I like younger girls, mm -hmm. girls that are younger than I am. Right. Not not eleven or whatever. But you like this eleven-year-old? No. no. Then why was she gonna put a ring on her finger when she turned fifteen? Is that not what you told her? No, I I didn't say that. Oh. I I don't think I did. John, you no. got to get honest, buddy. I, I don't. I mean, honey, it's all here. Do you not get this? You're you're lying about everything, but it, it's all. I have every single word you 
dead. Okay. Do you not understand that? Okay. Every who's this? Who's this lady? And you didn't see that one. Do you know who that is? That's that no, that's who wanted to be her mother, correct? That's that's a lady that I was talking to. Okay. So you're talking to overage women and cheating on your girlfriend as well. <laughs> And that's all you can do is chuckle. No, I'm um, you're a piece of shit. Come on. This woman takes you in her house. Yeah. And so like, leaving you out there in that piece of shit trailer. Yes. No power, no light. Trash everywhere. Trash somewhere. everywhere. We had to step over trash to get to the door. Because, yeah, we just come from there. I've talked to everybody in your family. I know everything. Okay. Everything. About your nieces and nephews? Everything. I know it all. Okay. And this woman takes you in her house and this is what you do to her? This is how you repay her? I mean, are you kidding me? Um, how, how is this Your honesty. That's how you get honest. We want to say. I want to go over the things you said. Will you please go get my, um, drink. Yeah. I'm freaking thirsty. I got her doctor. I got her. Yeah. <laughs> I'm a Pepsi right drink. now. I'm a Pepsi. She's Pepsi. Pepsi. Um, when I get back, I'll be honey. Yeah, I'm a, she's a Dr. Pepper drinker though. She stays on that. I like Dr. Pepper. <laughs> yeah. Uh, uh, it's, uh, Pepsi's not sweet enough for me. I'm a big girl. <laughs> I can make sure it never happens again. You better make sure, because yeah, I mean, I will, you you committed like five or six felonies here. It'll, you would die in prison it'll, at your it'll, age. It'll never happen again. You would die in prison. Who's the fourteen-year-old you're talking to? I have her too, John. I got I, another book out there, so please don't lie. Don't make no, me go get I got, it. I got. I had probably over eight hundred friends. So how many that, underage kids are you talking to? That, that I really don't know because a lot of them don't tell me their age. They just, but, you know, she might have been, but. It, how many kids that you're aware of that are underage are you talking to? I'm going to say two. I'm going to guess more than that. I'm gonna say that you say two because I brought up two. Well, Zoomer is the only two that I can recall. But um, <coughs> if, 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 it'll never happen. I guarantee it will never happen. Um, Connor, you want to be the first person that she was with? First person she ever was with? Um, she said that she never been with anybody. Okay. You. Man, I didn't want to go through with this whole book. Well, I, <laughs> I, mean, I, really I, I said I would love to be that person. And yeah, she, John, she didn't say anything. This kid didn't say nothing. Really? I mean, this kid didn't say anything. I mean, they would say, oh, okay, why? Oh, okay. I mean, they for, for three pages, they didn't even talk to you. You wouldn't stop pestering her. So she did talk to you. I mean, there, there. Have you ever dated anybody older than you, Paige? No, I haven't. My mom won't let me. I'm too young to think of boys. I'm not a boy, Paige. I'm a man. Yeah. There you go. Are you interested in me, Paige? I don't know. I could be the first person that you're with. She says, ha ha. Yeah. She never said anything about not being with anybody. She said, ha ha. She didn't know she's interested in you. Never said anything about being with anybody. You asked her if she had And you taught her how to Correct? Well, she told me that she knew how to do it. Well, she did. John, I mean, really, come on, dude.
Are you serious? I mean, are you... Okay. Are you really going to keep doing this? I mean, do you see all these red tabs? Yeah. That's everything that you said that was... And that's not even all of them. I didn't mark every page. Okay. That's everything you said. Well, it'll, what about um, it'll, these videos you sent her? What about that? Somebody sent me that. Disgusting, nasty videos you sent her. People having. Um, so where are we going from here? Uh, well, this is where we're going. We're having a discussion. Okay. okay. That's exactly where we're going. There's another one he sent. Of some girl. And she knew how to. But you had to send her a video to show her how to do it. Now, did she know how to. John. She said she'd never done it before. She said she'd never done it before. Exactly. And you told her how. And why. Because it feels good. Yeah. Makes you feel good. This kid said nothing. They knew nothing. They had never had a boyfriend. You introduced an 11 year old. 11. That's like fourth or fifth grade. Do you know how this screws kids up when you tell them stuff like this that they don't need to know about? So what about when this kid's your age and she can't have a productive relationship because you f***ed her head up when she was 11? Sorry for that. Did anybody ever do anything to you when you was younger? Yeah. You was messed with when you were younger? Did it mess you up? What did it do to you? Maybe guess what? Okay, so, uh, and that's where probably your nephew come in at that point? Mm -hmm. The one that used to stay with you and play video games. I don't, I, I'm not saying any names of anybody. Yeah, me and we, we were friends. I mean, he'd always come down the house and we'd eat wings and watch WrestleMania. Did you ever have any um, family members that Neighbors. things might have been that you've done anything to? No. 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 no family members. No. I've had, had people do things to me. But. Okay, well, you're not the victim here, so I don't feel bad for oh, you. Oh. <laughs> At all. That, that. Um, but, I mean, regardless if you tell the truth about that or not, you you have victimized people. You have victimized people. I don't know if you've seen it as that. But I met someone this morning that you victimized. And as soon as I said your name, I seen the fear in her eyes. I didn't. I didn't mean to do that. You yeah. did, though. So the thing I can say is and here you're doing it again. Um, you might not be doing it physically, but you're doing it emotionally. And I mean, you kind of did do it physically. You changed 
Um, do you do you see his Facebook? Yeah. Who are you in a relationship with on Facebook? I've had several women. Who are you in a relationship right now with on Facebook? Who did you just change it to? Do I need to pull the picture out of that too? It was her. And she said, no, take that off there. And I was like, okay. And what did you say? What would you tell her? I'll take it off if what? I'll, I'll take it off. If what? If you... Go ahead. You know what you, you said. For me. What was that? What she never did before. What? Play with herself. What? Play with herself. John, <laughs> I'm gonna is tell it, you. Right? I'm gonna. You you talking to all kinds of girls, ain't you? Yeah, there's over eight hundred of them. I'm talking about kids, John. Cause nope, that's not right. I mean, what you told this kid. So that's another kid. That's a different kid you're talking to. No, no this is not right. You you made was making this girl would not shut up with I love you, 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 I love you. And you told her you would not take down your post on Facebook about y'all being in a relationship unless she told you she loved you. I, I took it down anyway. But did you tell her that? Yes. This, this, that was this one. The one he's talking about, telling him about. They had to play with herself. I don't know who that is. That's some other kid he's talking to. Not none. He's supposed to be in a relationship with. With this child. That child. Okay, okay. He changed. And what, what did people say? People went crazy, didn't they? Yeah. Yeah, she put on there that he was in a relationship with an 11 year old who wouldn't go crazy on Facebook. Oh my god. So, yeah. Oh god. Any people y'all know on Facebook? <laughs> yeah. People commented on it and said, Are you kidding? This is a kid. Mm -hmm. He said, That's my daughter. So, you, you was, was you, how much sense does that make? No. You was having a relationship with your daughter? No. You, want, you would rather him think, that you had a relationship with your daughter than some random kid? I've never had this many notes. I usually come with a page. I can guarantee you it's a lot of I can't, I can't. I, 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 yeah, I can't believe in a word you say. Um, told her you wanted to be the one to show her what it feels like. You wanted to teach her where your went. And she told you that her mom told her that's adult things. That's things that adults do. And you told her, let me make you an adult. Let me make you an adult, an 11 year old. You wanted to make an adult. Thank you, honey. You wanted pictures of her in her bra and panties? Asked her for that. Bra. Bra? Or bra? English last B B R A. Brawl is a fight. B R A W L. That's a fight. B R A is a bra. What women wear. You want her in her bra and panties. You know something, John? This girl. This this is so. Excuse me. Disgusting. I have grandchildren. Have had grandchildren. Eleven years old. How could you do? This? How could you do it? Do you have no decency in your body whatsoever? 
She's a good looking woman. What's wrong with her? Answer. Give her an answer. Do you have any decency in you? I'm sorry. Sorry, don't get it. What about them little kids? Yeah. Sorry, don't get it. What about them little kids? You, you've screwed them up for life. Man, I love your girlfriend. We don't encounter that much. Most of the time, the girlfriends are taken up for you. I'm so glad that she's got a head on her shoulders and sees what a piece of you really are. Told her, uh, did, asked her if, uh, sent her a picker, picture of your and asked her if, uh, she thought it would all fit. Told her you'd, you'd take it gentle on her and take it an inch at a time. And once I take your I'll never leave you. More than likely you'll have a ring on your finger by the time you're 15. So you just talking to her right in front of her? Yeah. You're fine, baby. I mean, there you go. You trying to say that uh, she knew how to... You sent her a picture of a... And told her, you rub that thing right there on top. And that's how you... I mean, she ta how many times did she say, I'm just a kid? I'm just 11. And you just kept going with it. Eleven. Ain't you had her period yet? How would you feel this would happen to Elizabeth? Is that your daughter? Or? It's a girl that I raised mm -hmm. from the age of two until nine. It was his wife, Michelle, his first wife. Well, his only wife. She you understand her, her daughter. Now, he wouldn't be here to talk if he'd done something to her. Because her mom would have killed him. I was getting ready to say her it. Her biological it, it, dad. Right. And I took it over his father's baby. Did you do anything to her? No. So you were going to raise this girl? No. What would you say if I told you I talked to her before I come here? Well, I just seen her a couple of days ago, and she got out of her car and gave me a hug and told me she's still working at Walmart. And that's me how it was. She's twenty, I think twenty-seven now. Told her he's gonna teach her how to French kiss and stick your tongue down her throat. Now, this is why I ask you that. Because you wouldn't stop on this girl being your daughter. You wanted her to be your daughter. So you obviously have some sort of daddy-daughter fetish. So after saying you have a daddy daughter fetish, you're still gonna stick with you haven't victimized anybody. You've never victimized anybody. And because it cleans so well, 
It's all on the table now, John. Now's the time to come clean. Yeah, apparently I did victimize somebody because I was saying inappropriate things to. I'm not. Ta I'm talking about physically. You and a person in your proximity, not talking to somebody on the internet. I'm talking about physically victimizing someone. No, never. Um, yeah, we have. I am. I have never well, did anything with Elizabeth. Never. I'm not. I'm talking about anybody, John. Anyone. I'm not gonna throw names out. I'm not gonna tell you names because I'm not gonna let you. I mean, that that would be re-victimizing your victim. I'm not gonna say that. I'm not gonna say their names. I don't think it is. I mean, you don't think there was ever time you could have been drunk and, and did some things? No. 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 You drink an awful lot, don't you? Drink. I know you did when you were in that trailer. Because the whole oh. porch is full of beer cans. No, it was worse than that before I cleaned it off. Yeah. That was clear, like halfway up to the kitchen window when you started cleaning that. So, you don't think at any point you was drunk enough to do something? No. Okay. No. Is you gonna try to um have this girl come live with you? Um, none of this will happen again. Never. Was you gonna try to have this girl come live with you? I wouldn't have been able to take care of her, but I I did ask her. I mean, you, you, uh, um, bombarded this kid with, I love you, I love you, I love you. I, like, you wouldn't, you wouldn't leave her alone. She even said, okay, yeah, you keep saying that. You keep telling me that. Okay, I've already heard it. I was trying to get you to stop, and you wouldn't stop. Uh uh. No. I mean, I love you freaking probably 50 times in this book. He begged her for what, nine pages? Mm hmm. Nine pages begging her to. Begging her to. Mm -hmm. For nine, nine of these pages. We counted on our way here. Nine pages. She kept saying, no, I don't want to. No, I don't want to. No, I don't want to. And you kept on and kept on and kept on and kept on. Would not stop. Elementary school. Mm -hmm. Elementary school. Yeah. That's where mm -hmm. I think your vulnerability is created. And so I was Guaranteed it'll never happen. How long did it take you to start to finish what do you it, think it, should, it shouldn't happen. What before. do you think should happen to people that do this kind of stuff? <laughs> Not you. Take you out of the equation. If this was somebody that did this to the girl you raised, what should happen to them? Uh, they'd have a death sentence on them. A death sentence? Yeah. Because 
family members would go after them. So, I mean, is that what should happen to you? Should we hang up by your toenails and rain? Call the police? I mean, what do we do? What's the... What's my guarantee that you're never going to do this again? What would you like? I thought we should come from you. Yes. Thank you so much for being here with us. I'll, I'll, I'll give you, I'll do whatever. I can, I can guarantee you that. I'm not going to be here. And basically, I'd, I'd cut both my arms off before I'd let that happen again. Um, basically, the way this goes usually is if you're honest from the beginning, we, uh, you know, try to give you a chance. Um, you've lied to me all the way up till just a while ago. I mean, yeah, you, you, you was getting a little bit honest, but you, you have tried to b your way through this. You did mean to do that, John. Come on, I mean, come on, lay it out on the table. I mean, heck, the gig's up. You're caught. Your girlfriend knows. Your family knows. They've already all been told about it. I mean, the way I hear it, they don't want shit to do with you anyway. No, no, no. I mean, the one person that does, <laughs> you do this too. Yeah. Yeah. Now it's probably one person that did. I would do, I mean. Ain't got nobody else in the world but this lady over here. And you f her over. You're a winner, John. About all that. Huh? I said I don't know about all that. Oh, I, I wasn't meant. Yeah, mm -hmm. that was that was sarcasm. <laughs> Told her you wanted to be her one and only. She let you take her. You wanted to be her first and last. Because y'all was getting married. You remember all the, the nasty pictures you sent her? You remember all them? How old is that girl? 19. 19? She looks awful young. I, I assume so. Because he, he sent it to this child. Showing her how to masturbate. Oh Where'd you get that one from? Girl sent it to me. Girl, another girl sent it to you? I mean, if you don't put him out, I'm coming back to put him out. Yeah, you said you were a dumbass. You're not a dumbass. You're only a dumbass if you keep him now. You didn't know about it before. I'm mm -hmm. <laughs> How many people are you? Uh, how many people are you cheating on this lady with, including children and adults? 
Are you actively seeing somebody? You're just talking to them all online and sending dirty pits pictures back and forth. Talking nasty to them. Why would you do somebody like that? If I'm here, you will. Tell her. I'm sorry. No, don't tell her you're sorry. Why would you do it? Why did you do it? Because I'm a screwed up individual. You didn't give two shits about what she felt. You are just worrying about what John felt. John getting off. And John seeing nasty, dirty pictures from girls. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Exactly. A little girl can't give you a house and a shower and a place to eat and electric, but she can. Yeah. So you'll get your. You get and, a, on the and, side. A, and a vehicle. He's probably using your vehicle, oh, yeah. right? Yeah. Because yeah. yeah. yours, yours ain't legal anymore, right? Mm -hmm. I gotta get to the Cadillac and inspect mm -hmm. it. Yeah, not legal. Yeah. <laughs> we know a lot about you, John. A lot. In case you can't tell that. I'll, I'll never pop up on that radar again. I don't believe that. You honestly like children? I don't believe that one bit. I, I can promise you I can guarantee you that I won't. What are you going to do to stop you from liking children? You need help. Don't you? Then that's what I want. You need to have yourself committed and... Go from there. Seek all kinds of counseling. Mm -hmm. I don't know if that's going to help. Mm -hmm. Y'all have any kind of state hospital down here? Like, wait, you said committed? Is like. Yeah, there's uh, Weston. No, there's some. Um, yeah. what's, what's the one for. Rehabilitation services. Mm -hmm. Upper body. I'm just saying, Weston, because that's what I always knew growing up, you know. Right. I always heard about Weston because the hospital, but they were going to turn around and say, I think. Well, he's a criminal and he's insane, so. <laughs> I mean, you, you, uh, you, uh, you would die. You would rot in jail. Yes. I'm, I'm aware of that. I mean. You wouldn't have to worry about how you that. Oh, yes, he would. <laughs> hmm? Oh, yeah, he would. No, I mean, you'd be uh -huh. Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. He'd, ha he'd have to worry about it. He'd have to worry about it. Because you ain't big enough at all to hold Bubba back. Mm -mm. An 11 year old thing in there. Yeah. You ever been to jail for anything? Yeah. So he knows all about what they do. What you go to jail for? There. DUI. How long did you do? Just 24 hours. That's all you've done? No, never went back. Did it scare you? Yeah. Do you know what they do to people like you in there? Yeah. It's 
to do. Not pretty. What you got? Disgust. What? I mean, did you really think that was going to play out? That you were going to marry her? Mm -hmm. No. I didn't really think it happened. No. I didn't. Do you think that she did? You think she would want you? No. 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 Then why do it? Let's go from the head. This, uh, this man right here is a man of God. Mm -hmm. I was reading this coming down the road. I had to make him laugh to get him out of his head, the things he wanted to do to you. I, I couldn't believe it. I could not believe someone would be that depraved and do that to a child. And, and, and to have that fantasy, because even if you didn't think that it was gonna play out, you were still fantasizing about it. And she did. I, mean, I, I was over there. She was reading stuff, and I was I was just stupid because I was thinking, man, you know, awful. I mean, I know what it would be like. Well, we're in West Virginia. You know, we're from in the, we're down south, but uh, I know what people would do. They got a hold of you. And I told her, I said, I, I'm thinking things I shouldn't be thinking. But um, she said a little something and uh, got me laughing, and I thanked her for it. Cause I don't like, I don't like those feelings. I don't yeah, like, exactly. I like those thoughts, you know. Uh, I just don't understand. You know, we've watched movies and stuff before. And stuff. And we've talked about that. And then you go around, or you become one? What the hell do you think you were doing, John? You know? Didn't really know. Well, I had, really I had to have known. I just didn't think of the consequences of it. Well, you only have to think of the consequences now. <coughs> this is costing you so much more than you ever intended. And that's what I would think whenever I would see someone's life. I mean, just, you know, what's going through your head now? I mean, you woke up this morning and you didn't ever think that we were going to be here. Mm -hmm. You know? Yeah. But think about the little kids, John. Yeah. Should have never been put to it. No, they shouldn't. I mean, they'll have to live the rest of their life with that. I should have never let that happen. Well, I did it. Yeah. Well, I tell you what, if I had been an 11 year old girl and you had done that to me, my family would have killed you. I can tell you that right now. Oh, my way of saying. I've often said if anything happened to my daughter like that, that would be the one reason I'm going to go to jail. Yeah. Exactly. Me too. I forgot about my kids. I forgot about my grandchildren. Yeah. And he's right here. You know? Yeah. <laughs> Thank goodness. Grandchildren all live here. Yep. Yeah. Yeah, if he was actually my babies, I can tell you what. There'd be no mushes. Uh, 
so um. Why you gonna help? Yeah. Hold on. I know. I know you love me. I know you love me. I yeah, know. I'll, I'll I'll go up and talk to people at Valley tomorrow. Valley Mental Mental Health. And tell them that I need to start seeing somebody. Is there an, um, anything uh, that you can get in for like a um, 72 hour evaluation? Uh, yeah, they can do that up there. Can you not call like 911 and have an ambulance take you there? Well, I got, I got to go up and talk to the person and tell them that I want to be kept for 72 hours. Even if the and, ambulance would take you? I don't know if they'd do it if an ambulance took you. Well, I think we're going to get there by ambulance because my car's out. Well, you can take me up there and drop no, me off. No, I'm not taking you. I, then I'll call an ambulance. I'm not taking you anywhere. Mm -hmm. You want to go ahead and call him? Um, um, can... This is your house. It's your decision. What? What do you want done? Well, if you don't do that, we'll just leave the hand into the cops either way. I'm, I'm not messing here. around with I'm you. I'm done. Well, let me let me get my clothes and then I'll call and get an ambulance. Okay. Don't look at me. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I can't tell you what to do. Go back if you want to. It's her house. Sure it gets everything. Okay, you're fine, baby. We're gonna step out and smoke. Okay. That's fun. You guys um, want something to drink now? You want a water, a Pepsi? No, I got mine here. Um, if you uh, you want something? I got some, baby. You're fine. Thank um, you. If you need anything, you call her. If you try to do anything, yeah, we'll right anything right okay. All right, guys. Are you here? Are you with me? All right. This is what's going on. No, I did not get to pee. Listen. All right, so he's saying he's going to go turn himself into a hospital for 72 hours so he can try to get, so he can try to get help. Um, the cops called me back and they are not going to respond. They are not going to respond. <laughs> Um, he is getting kicked out of his girlfriend's house. No matter where he goes, he's getting kicked out of here. Um, covered. I am too. Where's... Uh, I don't know, baby. I don't have any. You opened them. Um, remember? Did you leave them in the car? Um, but, uh, we do have somebody contacting us that does want that. Do you hear me? Uh, they do want the case. Oh, yeah? Yep. Okay. They want the case, but they said... From there. That we have to go to them and that their ICAC unit will investigate it. Okay. Okay. Thank you, Vanessa and Lisa. Great job. That was a little bit different. CPP, CPP, WV always calls the police and does the interview exposure. They cannot contain what police do. Exactly, Janie. Exactly. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Right, yes, Steve. That's what they said. He called me back. If y'all did not hear, my phone rang while we were in there, and he called me back and said that he, um, they do not respond to on-site for this, but ICAC will look into it. They'll be contacting us, and we can give them over everything we have. Shout out to SOCI. If y'all want to stick here. around with us, here, we're going to stay here um, with this girl with this woman and give her all our support guys until he gets his ass out of here thank you SEO for the 20 thank you so much thank you so much y'all want to stick with this we're going to stick with this woman for now till he leaves but he does have victims guys and They'll, they they'll come, they'll come up. They, they'll, they'll come forward. They will.
Yeah, that Imagine said, I'm new to this. I just can't hardly believe it. Oh, cool that, uh, They wouldn't do. Sure, maybe. Hold on, I'm going to ask her to use this one. Yeah. I gotcha. Um, well, I, I need to go to Dallas, and I'm just having some problems. Um, apparently, it's been going on for a while, and I, I was going there to have them keep me for 72 hours. And, and really get some help. I mean, really, really dive into this and, and be honest. I mean, if you can't be honest in front of her, go be honest with them. You need to really soul search and, and uh, think because you have, you have hurt people. I'm not talking about kids on online. I'm talking about you have hurt real people. So when you um when you make advances on somebody, what's your intentions then? Do you know what I'm talking about now? You know who I'm talking about? Don't say no names. I, I have never physically did that to anybody. I've over the internet, things like that, but never physically. Never physically touched anybody or fondled anybody. You know. You've never even went up to someone and tried to make a advance at them. That's well, that's where I'm talking about you need to soul search. Because you you've uh I don't know if you um I don't know. I don't know what the excuse is if I'll, I'll I don't know. I'll definitely get this taken care of and Will never happen again, and I will be well, um, we will be turning this into place, just so you know. So, you possibly could be hearing from them also. I'll be at the valley. I mean, did you think, did you think this would happen? Did you think you'd get caught? Well, I did some of the things that I did. I didn't think it'd come full circle. I just didn't. Guess, I'm, guess I was wrong.
so then what was you thinking when you was doing it? I, I wasn't. I wasn't thinking about anybody but myself. Just getting off, basically? Basically. You didn't care who it was with? Never mess with that dog in there, have you? No. I mean, you laugh, no, but no. I mean, we we have fought guys before that you know have done things like that. So no, I, no, I when uh when you're um going down to an 11 year old I have to ask that question could you look right here at this camera and say I've been quacked I've been quacked Say it loud, do it loud. I've been quacked. Thank you. That's our mascot, is a duck. Oh. <laughs> so when we catch you guys, we call it you've been quacked. You've been quacked by CPPWV. I won't ever be quacked again. <laughs> I, yeah. I can guarantee you that. Because I'm going to get the help. Well, you, you, uh, you better, I mean. Yeah, I am. I mean, that's, that's why I came out here to call the answer. You guys are just one of those who need that. All right. Well, yeah, because the uh, only thing it's going to do to me is it'll let me catch you again. That won't happen. That but, uh, happen. you, next time, it might not be me. It might be the police you're talking to. It might be a real kid you're talking to. Or a parent. Yep. You didn't get to meet up with this kid. No. We made sure to stop to it before you could. Sure and her uh, her uncle wanted to come. How long, how long have you been doing this online? Talking to girls. Probably. Talking to underage girls. Just recently. Just recently for younger other girls. Yeah, I've been talking to them for like eight years. How long have you been with this lady? Like 17. 17 years? You're gonna be homeless probably, right? Yeah. You ever been homeless before? Huh? No. Awful cold time of the year. Yeah. Yeah. I wouldn't suggest uh going back to that trailer though, if I was you. I wouldn't try that at all. Uh, I know you're not allowed there anymore so uh you go back there and you're probably gonna end up in jail Um, just so you know, you're live on YouTube right now.
These people don't like you at all. At all. Mr. Cooley said he does not like you at all. At all. And Cooley's cool, that's right. Has uh, any kids sent you any pictures on there? None. You don't have any kind of kids' pictures on there at all that you've deleted? Because you know what that is, right? They found that on there. And and like we said, you know, don't matter if you delete that stuff, it, they can still find it. The past eight years, this has been happening. So he's been with you for 17. It's been going on for the past eight. Couldn't even finish watching the videos you sent. They were disgusting. Disgusting.
Exactly. Exactly. That's awesome. <laughs> right. Even even if they turn him down, guys, he's homeless now. He's on the street. So. <laughs> they asked him what it was. They was like, what is all that? He said, my clothes. Exactly, that's right. Kids can go trick-or-treating here now. Right, right, Matt. Hey, I don't give a fuck as long as I can get them out. You know what? At least he's going to have to go tell somebody what he did. He's going to have to be accountable for what he did. And he's going to have to get some sort of help for at least 72 hours. So, right. Yeah. And hopefully within that time, the police go talk to him. Um, I'm not saying him being homeless fixes anything, but if the police are telling us they're not going to come, the next best thing we can do is get him help. Yeah. I said him being homeless isn't going to fix anything. <laughs> I know that, but you know what? He's out of her house. Exactly. She's not um, having to take care of him, pay for his phone bill. Um, and it's still being handled over to police. Exactly. It's <laughs> been handed over to police still. They still might, um, right. I mean, yeah, um, therapy or nothing usually helps these guys, but you know what? Exactly, Beth. It's something. I can't just leave here and not do nothing and just leave him sitting in there. Couldn't do it. Let me get out of here. And the police, police, police. All right, guys. Um, you guys obviously aren't going to be able to go in with us. But, um think that we're in the right spot. Yep, yep, yep. On Galen County, yep. Morning Jaywalks. Okay, Chaos, we'll check it soon in just a minute. Um, anyways, though, you guys aren't going to be able to go in with us, so we're going to go ahead and get off of here. Dub baby. Dub with a Dub quack. B. You ever touch any of your grandkids? No, never. It's kind of hard for me to believe. All I can do is say the truth. I've never touched anybody. I thought about it, but I never did. Just thought about it. Yeah. 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 What's wrong on the internet? Talking to a decoy, but you don't know it yet. It's CPP West Virginia with the challenge. Tracking you by your IP, we got your bottle balls. We're chatting goes wrong on the internet. Talking to a decoy, but you don't know it yet. It's CPP West Virginia with the challenge. Tracking you by the IP, we got your bottle balls. Open up, G Vanessa. Is they serious? they serious? Or they're delirious? So we took it to another state because they're still curious. From Colorado to West Virginia. Rocky to the Appalachian Putting the pedal to the metal for pedals and demonstrate Got Tommy orchestrate, Vanessa duplicate Catching weirdos on the daily, they the most hated And the highest rated Catching cops, retired pops, and creepy husbands Looking for kids that ain't up in the age of a dozen Be aware and don't be surprised if you see your cousin Or your baby daddy while you got one in the oven Better hide your kids and hide your wife, no fun intended The jig is up, now you got to witness a marriage Ending. And once again, this is your first time messing with children And this is the second time you're hearing from the homie voice Another intro in the beat with a familiar voice Popping up like Chris Hansen and he brought the bad boy in that Talking to a decoy, but you don't know it yet It's CPP, West Virginia with the challenge Tracking it by your IP, we got your bottle balls What chatting goes wrong on the internet Talking to a decoy, but 
but you don't know it yet It's CBP, West Virginia with the cheddar laws Tracking you by the IP, we got you by the balls These are the people living next to you Maybe upstairs or even working in the job right next to you Or probably in the congregation fellowshipping with you A lot of wicked souls with skeleton trapped in the closet That's why we working together, thank you for your involvement If you're not supporting the plan, you're probably part of the problem The laws is messed up, we need to bring this back to Congress I say we get a ass to chair and I'm just being honest Taking innocence from a child, use a damn father Ask me why I bother Cause if you bother my daughters, I'll make you meet your father And it ain't no mercy for those that touch children No rehabilitation can make them a waste they victims Tommy this, Vanessa that, and blah blah that My question that I ask is where you at And what you gon' do when it happens to you Or your loved ones who you think is more precious than you She a chat goes wrong on the internet Talking to a decoy, but you don't know it yet It's CBP, West Virginia with the chat logs Tracking you by your IP, we got you by the balls The chatting goes wrong on the internet Talking to a decoy, but you don't know it yet It's CBP, West Virginia with the chat logs Tracking you by the IP, we got you by the balls Royce K, dude, so you know what I'm saying 37 years old, bro, 14 I, I know. And I what would you do if, if, if you have sisters, nieces, nephews? Nothing? Do you know anybody who's 13 or 14?